Welcome and thanks for watching. It's another beautiful day here in Kentucky and we're out here at my little mini range and someone asked, wonder how many rounds it would take through one of the little Mark Rugers and this happens to be the Mark II and uh, <laughs> for it to foul up or start jamming. Well, I don't know. Uh, the only time I've ever had one to jam, it was like, uh, it wasn't really jamming and it, it was low, low grade ammo. And, uh, I had mixed it up with some other stuff and it just wouldn't cycle. I mean, it just couldn't push it back. Uh, if you use thousand, uh, 1100 feet per second ammunition on these, uh, I've never had an issue. Uh, great little pistol. Now this one has been cleared before the video. I just want to make another that. Magazine's out. Chamber's empty. Now we've already been putting some rounds through this and let me tell you. <laughs> we're going uh, to give this a good try. We've got a uh, I think this is, uh, and hopefully we don't have to use all this, but this is, uh, 1,400 rounds, I think, uh, the Remington, uh, hollow points, and then we got a case of G a Gila, uh, and, uh, these are standard velocity, 1,130 feet per second. Seems to do well in this little pistol where he tried some. We've got Winchester White Box. We got Federal Value Pack, Federal Auto Match, some more Aguila, more, uh, it's a little higher velocity Aguila, standard velocity. And these actually, uh, the CTI, Standard velocity actually cycles through this little pistol. Now, we're going to count if we run out with any 22 ammunition. You're going to have every now and then a dud. Oh, well, it just won't go off. So, uh, what we'll do, we won't, we're not going to count that because that's not actually a jam or a foul up. Uh, it's just the ammunition. But what we're going to do, we're going to start back up, and we've already put, I don't know, 80, 90 rounds through this, maybe. And uh, so we're just going to, and it was clean before we started. Uh, we cleaned it all up, and this one hasn't been shot, not, not a whole lot at all. So uh, basically breaking this one in, and then how many rounds it's actually going to take. So uh, stick with me. Uh, we're going to put some plugs on and do some more shooting uh, and see what it's going to do. So give me just a minute. Okay, let's uh, get started back up and see what this is, uh, how many rounds it's going to take for this little pistol to foul up. Uh, <laughs> I think I'm going to be here for a while, so uh, let's see what we can do here. Uh, we're going to uh let's see let's start with that silhouette there get the safety off uh, let's see there we go and there's one magazine uh <laughs> no problem let's let's keep going let's see what we can do here all right let's see there we go There, I'm telling you what. We're going to keep going. <laughs>
low velocity. It wasn't a jam. It just, uh, that was, uh, <laughs> that was a dud. Mm. Well, guys, I, we had one foul up there, and it was, uh, <laughs> actually, I was trying to throw these old bullets in here. I don't know what they are. Uh, 22 rounds. Uh, <laughs> we went through fiddles, aguilas, uh, normas, uh, uh, a bunch of these. There's no need of wasting very much more ammo. <laughs> These little pistols are reliable. Anybody that's on one, <laughs> the Ruger Mark II. Ah, hey, let me tell you, any of these style pistols, I've never had a really a issue. Uh, uh, the 2245, when they first come out, uh, a little pin here in front. Uh, which uh, it just wore a little bit in there and it was fixed after that and uh, never had no more problem. We put a sleeve in there, actually a little copper sleeve through that polymer frame and it uh, it actually fixed that. But with these metal frame Mark II uh, and the new 2245, uh, uh, there's just not, as I know of, uh, any a lot of issues <laughs> and you're you're going to be going through a lot of ammo to foul bomb these up i mean actually get a, 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 a honest to goodness jam uh foul up out of one of these great little shooting pistols uh <laughs> i thought i'd give this a try but no. you can go out to the range and have a lot of fun and not have to worry about a foul up or jamming uh you clean it before you go, and you're going to shoot all the ammo you want to shoot, and I don't think you'll have any problems or issues out of that. So, guys and girls, if you have one of the Mark II or these style pistols in the Ruger, get down, even the 2245, get down in the comment section and let me know what you think. I would love to hear from you. And as always, guys and girls, we appreciate you watching. We do thank you for all your views and comments. And subscribe to the channel so you don't miss anything. And give us a big thumbs up. It helps. And we'll see you the next time. Out here at my little mini range. Having some fun on the walk without. Thank you ever so much.